Thanks for coming. It's a really nice place. Tweety, could you move the table back? Don't be a stranger. Well, another one bites the dust. Well, they look good together. Remember when you were dating Kelly? <laughs> Don't even. I thought you two would be good together. Vegan. So? What about you and those white dreads? Yeah, too fucking political. You're the one who said that it's insensitive to go pick up at Take Back the Night. We all have our line. And anyway, I pulled out of that quick, right? She kept on saying she was an Indian princess in a previous life. I don't want to date anymore. I'm either too political, too old, or too butch. I got your back, okay? You have to choose women seeking women. And within how many miles? You have to go miles? Over broken glass and rusted nails. Jesus, that's the photograph you picked? How did you ever get a girl before? What the fuck, yoga? Trust me, it's not a lie. It's, it's an embellishment. No, it tells people that you're self-aware. You take care of yourself. Remember, it's just coffee. You're not going to marry her. Right. It's not like dinner. Uh, dinner's a commitment. Personally, I think it's kind of weird watching someone eat on a first date. What do you mean? Well, that's a social ritual. It's not that chewing in front of a stranger. But coffee, it's quick, in and out. You know, just in case you're not feeling the... The what? Uh, the vibe, the connection. You'll know in 10 minutes tops. What, 10 minutes? You know, you know. 10 minutes, that's brutal. All's fair. I mean, it's a dyke eat dyke world. <laughs> Please don't ever say that in public again, ever. I don't want to talk about it. I fucking hate the world. Vegan. Rumi. I'm doing it my way. No computer, no yoga, no coffee. Just me and my time. You look good. Okay. So I'm gonna take my tired ass down to the diner and we're gonna have dinner. Okay? Okay. Okay. Good. Where the hell have you been? <laughs> Jesus. That really is like riding a bike. Bud. Where the hell have you been? What do you mean? You got a girlfriend and you disappear. You said to go out and have fun. Fuck yeah. Listen, 
This is the first time that I'm happy in a long time. I didn't mean it like that. Yeah, whatever. You know, this is not how friends treat each other. What am I supposed to do? It's like she's frozen in time. She's like a dinosaur. Dinosaurs are extinct. Do you know what I mean? I want to move in with Sarah. Like, don't get me wrong, we've been through a lot. But things change. Everything changes. That's the way life goes. So, how are you going to tell her? Is that okay? Sure, that's great. Well, that's it. Don't be a stranger. Women seeking women. And Joy's um, long walks alone. Favorite game, solitaire. If you could bring one thing to a deserted island, what would it be? Just tell me she didn't ask you to check up on me. I just don't like it. You two not talking? You are like Tom and Jerry. Tom and Jerry were enemies. They were a cat and a mouse. They were fucking cartoons. Just come to the damn party. You want to talk anyway, okay? Remember when we were young and we'd go to all the rallies and the demos and the protests and we did all that work, petitions, fine postering, and now we have Black Lives Matter, we have Idle No More. The thing is, we still have it. And December 6 rolls around every year. And it doesn't fucking matter because we didn't change a damn thing. When I look back on my life, do you know what I think? I just think about the wasted time. Just wasted time. Just come to the damn party. I'm so sorry, I just... It's okay. You okay? So you're happy? Just come by for a drink. That'd be nice. 